Okay, so this next video is not a beauty video. It is going to be discussing something that's kind of popular right now, and I'm going to sip my wine while I uh, talk about this with you all. Um, so, as most of you know, I'm, I'm certain most of you know, there's a, like a fad or a trend going on right now called planking. Um, planking, if you don't know, is when um, somebody goes somewhere, most, most of the time it's in some obscure place, like say you are on top of the golden arches at McDonald's, like you pose, you lay down on top of something straight, like stiff as a board with your arms at your side, face down, and you have somebody take a picture. And then what makes it humorous to people is the fact that it happens in these like random obscure places. Okay, the reason I know about it um, and really looked into it is because my fiance thinks it is the funniest thing in the world. And I have to admit that some of the pictures I saw were kind of funny, right? But, um, and so it originated, they say, like over in Europe or the UK, something um, with Caucasian people. And they started it maybe a few years ago and it's just now like gaining popularity over here and coincidentally gaining popularity among black people, African Americans, however you choose to identify. So um, like I said, my fiance he thinks it's like extra funny and he's trying to think of the best place to do it, right? So, so it started gaining popularity, right? And of course, there are the naysayers or the people who are like, like I did in my last video, you know, I have to name people. Uh, as if people don't have nothing better to do with their lives, like, why you gotta do this, like, oh, okay, whatever, fold your boat, blah, 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 black people this, black people that, I think it's stupid, why we gotta do that, blah, blah, blah. So eventually, somebody dug a little deeper irritated by it and found out that it emulates the way that slaves were transported here from Africa. So it's how they used to like stack people up on the ship. Um, so I guess once they found that out then it was like oh know your history people and why would you want to participate in something that is emulating something that caused us so much hardship and blah blah blah, black people were so stupid, yada yada blah, this, that, and third, right? So I was reading my blogs a little while ago, maybe about an hour ago, and yet another post, like this has been going on for the past couple of weeks, people speaking out against it and saying it's stupid, a lot of celebrities hopped on to it so that brought it even more attention, right? Um, so I was reading one of my blogs, um, Nicole Bitchy, right? So Exhibit and Tank um, spoke out about it, right, via Twitter. And I'm looking at my laptop right now so I can specifically quote what they were, not specifically quote it, but like give you a gist of what they were saying. So Exhibit was like, it is the dumbest ish ever. Planking was a way to transport slaves on ships during the slave trade. It's not funny. Educate yourselves. Don't get it twisted. I care less where you dumb A's lay face down and take pictures of ish. I'm just telling you where it came from. So then Tank tweeted, We oftentimes follow a trend when we don't understand its beginning. Planking is not sexy if you know the origin. Wake up, black people. The general. So... Like, <laughs> I don't know. I just feel like life is real. It can be real hard for some people. Like, some people can't even survive the day-to-day -day of life. Like, some of them feel like they can't go on and they, you know, they leave. I'm just going to put it that way. They leave, right? So, if somebody gets a little humor or 
they find some kind of release in acting silly, then what is so what's wrong with that? Like what's so wrong about it? If you can't if you have to be oh so serious all the time, then you just need to stay in your little corner. And I mean this is so such a weighty topic for me. Sorry, my pet's itching on my forehead. Um because I understand people want to show a certain level of maturity. There are things that I can't do anymore as a mom, as somebody of a certain age. You, you know, you get to a certain point where, like, like say I can't walk around in whatever Daisy Dukes and a tube top, or I wouldn't feel right wearing a baby tee that says whatever. I don't. I can't even think of anything on it like a baby tea with Winnie the Pooh on it like you know you get to a certain age and you just don't feel like you can do certain things anymore but for things that are like not hurting people who cares and I know people are entitled to their opinion and I, this is just what I'm doing I'm voicing mine so you know some people might not agree I'm sure a lot of people don't agree but it's my channel my video my opinion um and I invite you all to share yours too. Like, help me understand why. And I'm I'm not too familiar. Let me preface it by saying that, as far as you know, I know Tank's music. He's an R&B singer or whatever. He works a lot with Jamie Foxx. Okay. I haven't really heard him say anything, uh, of kind of off the cuff or you know off color any off color remarks. But Exhibit, he's a rapper. I'm not too too familiar with his music. I know him from the Pimp My Ride show from MTV. That's when I first, like, really, I knew him from before a little bit, but I wasn't really into his music. I really knew him from that show. He was cool on the show. But he also, you know, jokingly or whatever, would use some words that some people might take offense to, right? Um, he wasn't specifically, like, intentionally trying to hurt somebody's feelings and doing it. Which is the same thing I feel like with people doing the planking thing. Um, but I'm sure he uttered the N-word or called a female a, a B. You know, maybe in his music. I don't know for certain. I'm, I'm speculating at this point. But perhaps he may have used some language that might have not been appropriate for all audiences. Let's just leave it at that. So what makes one better than the other you know especially with the n-word that is a word that causes some people a lot of strife you know um some people don't use it some people don't like for others to use it and um i swear i've heard him say it before sorry i'm like messing up my camera right now but so you can do that but people can't take pictures posing like you can I, I don't know. I just... <laughs> people kill me sometimes, you know. What gives you the right to determine which moral high ground is the high ground to take? You know, um, what makes you the moral compass where you can pass judgment on somebody for doing something that's like... Like, really? People are just taking pictures in, like, random places. Like, okay, I know the history behind it. But there's history behind a lot of things. Some people could argue that, um, oh, you're an administrative assistant. That's just the new age way of being a maid, which I kind of feel like that's what it is, you know? But, you know, oh, you're um, helping somebody, whatever. Like, you know, keeping their schedule or something, you know? That's the, um, that's not too far from being somebody's maid or something like that. You, you just never know how somebody's going to take something. So, people can't have fun. People can't let loose a little bit. Like, let it go. Why Why we have to take life so seriously? We're not here for that long. We're really not, you know, the life expectancy of male and females is not that high. And then you figure in people dealing with stress and you know environmental changes and just anything could make your time your short time here even shorter you know you never know when it's your time to go so if you can find uh, a little bit of 
solace and acting silly for the amount of time that it takes to snap a picture and post it online, which is like nothing now. You can instantly take a picture and it'll be online like that. People can't do that, and you're all up in arms and you're ready to like, oh my god, I'm just, oh, I can't, why? Oh, that's, seriously, it's not that serious. But I mean, this is just my opinion. Tell me how you feel about it. Do you think that planking is stupid? Do you think that, you know, it's just a trend or a fad that's going to go away, which I'm sure it is? But, you know, I'm asking you now, what, how do you feel about it? Am I, should I be more up in arms about it? I, I don't plan on taking part in it, but if somebody else wants to do it, I, I don't care. I got a whole lot of other things going on to be worried about whether somebody taking a, a picture uh, of them planking. I just don't see what the big whoop is. Um, you know, there's a lot of other important things to go on right now that, you know, we need to focus on. But, you know, again, let me know what you think. And thank you for watching this video. And I think this is the last video that I'm going to make tonight because now I have to edit. And it's going to take forever and a day. All right. So I will see you maybe tomorrow, maybe Sunday. We'll see. Thanks for watching. Bye.